So welcome back to Hips or Games, folks. Today we're going to do a mod tutorial for Final Fantasy IX on the Steam Deck. I'm going to install the latest version of Maguri Mod. This tutorial should take a little under 10 minutes to complete. And if you follow it to a T, I will guarantee you I'll get it up and running. Let's do this. Okay, so let's start the tutorial. So for the purpose of this tutorial, I'm recording this uh, via my capture card, so I have a laptop dock connected to my Steam Deck in order to get the best picture quality for this video. Now, the first thing you want to do is before we start anything else, okay, is to of course install a copy of Final Fantasy IX. Okay, so go ahead and install that. And the first thing you want to do as well is you want to make sure that you hit the play button, okay? So we're going to start the game once and close out of it immediately. And this is before we do any mods or an anything else as part of this tutorial. This is part is very important. Please make sure that you launch the game and create a profile for that game in the Steam folder. So once the game starts loading, you can exit out of it straight away. Don't even bother doing anything. Don't even create any save data or anything. So that's the profile for the game created on your Steam Deck. The next thing what we're actually going to do at this stage is we're going to go to the Steam menu. We're going to go to power and we're going to go switch to desktop because we're going to do the work in desktop mode and then we will go back into the game mode at the end of the tutorial. But once you're back in desktop mode, what you're going to want to do first is actually open a standard Steam session. So not gaming mode, but open a standard Steam session. And what we want to do here is we want to go to view games. So view games library and go to install locally and find your installation of Final Fantasy IX. And I find it's the easiest way to actually find the local install folder. So right click and go to properties and then go down to install files and you're going to click browse. And this will open up the directory that we need to have open. And I'll explain shortly in a moment. So leave that window open. You can close down the Steam session for now. And we're going to just drag this to the side. The next thing we want to do is we want to go ahead and open up a browser window and we're going to type Magori mod. We're going to go to the Magori mod website and if we go to install and then you can go ahead and download the latest version by using the download button here. Be bear in mind it's about five gigabytes in size so it might take some time to download. Let this download. So once the download is complete, you can go to the downloads folder. I'm just going to cut the entire zip file and I'm going to go back into my Final Fantasy 9 directory and paste it in here. And then what you're going to do is right click, extract, extract the archive to here. That will take a few moments. As I said, it's five gigs in size. So once that's extracted, you can go ahead and delete the zip. We don't need that. And what we do need is we need the Magori Mod EXE. We need the Mag Magori Mod zip files and then this other zip as well. So there's one two and three files okay so we can minimize this window for a moment open up a steam session we're going to go to games i'm going to go add non-steam games library go to browse and then select magori mod.exe within that folder and hit add selected programs and what you'll do then is you'll find magori mod I'm going to go right click it properties go to compatibility force the use of specific steam play compatibility tool and I'm going to use version 7.0-6. This is the one I know that works. So once that's selected and you have checkbox the forced to use a specific Steam Play compatibility tool version 7.0-6, hit the X button here and we're going to hit play. And that's going to run the Magori Mod installer. So once the wizard comes up, what you're going to do is you're going to go next. Now, important here, do not install it to the default directory location. We need to use, delete that, and we need to use the directory where we have Final Fantasy IX installed. So back to where we had our folder open. If you just click here where the cursor is at the end, you should be able to see the entire directory tree or structure. You can select all of this, right click, copy, and then within here, you're gonna go right click and paste. So you want to put that directory, installation directory, in here for the Magori mod setup. So it's going to be home deck dot local share Steam Steam apps common Final Fantasy IX, and within that Final Fantasy IX folder. So hit next, and then go install, 
and let that install. Again, it's going to take some time, so be patient with it. Once that's finally extracted, just hit finish. And what we're going to do now is we're going to just do a little bit of housekeeping first. So we can actually get rid of this zip file here. We can delete this and we can delete this because they take about five gigs in space and they've exported and extracted into the folders in, in inside Magori files. So you don't need to hold the zip files again. So get rid of those two. You can actually get rid of Magori mod as well. You can delete this. And what you can also do is if you want, you can open up this. So go back into your installed locally um, expand that out in Steam. And you can actually remove the Magori mod EXE. So get rid of 8.3.00. You can go right click. You can go manage and remove non-Steam game. You don't need that there either. And then lastly, what you can go is you can go to trash. You can empty out your trash folder because it's probably about 10 gig of additional space there that you're going to need in the future. And what we're going to do is now we're going to return to gaming mode. And when you're back in gaming mode, let's go ahead and launch Final Fantasy IX. You can just launch it as default. Again, remembering to have at least created a profile first before you go ahead and install the mod. Just a reminder. So hit play. And as you can see, Final Fantasy IX using the Magori mod has launched. I think I'm going to have to create a new game. If I continue. Ah, it saved my game. Great. And as you can see, Magori mod is actually working because it's using the high re high resolution render backgrounds and you can also see it's running in 16 by 9. And yeah, folks, I just move into another screen just to give folks another little glimpse. As you can see, it's using the higher resolution backgrounds. Overall, I think this is the best way to experience Final Fantasy IX on the Steam Deck. Anyway, folks, hopefully this helped people. Uh, drop a comment down below if it has, or if you have any issues, let me know. I really appreciate it, folks, liked and subscribed. If this has helped you, it really helps my channel. And I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching, guys.